Hello children, this is class 12 mathematics 041, math lab activity 3. In this activity we are going to demonstrate the function which is not 1 to 1 but on to. I have taken two strips, the strips x, the strip x denotes the domain y denotes the range we have taken the elements in such a way it will match the uh, on to function not the one to one function so we are connecting in such a way to demonstrate the same given type of function it should not be one to one here by this we will be noting two and three both are having the same image so it is not one to one it is actually a many to one function as both the elements are connected in the co-domain, both the elements A and B are having pre-images. So, it is an onto function. Right? So, we are demonstrating to justify our demonstration, we have taken elements like this and connected like this. So, what we are doing? We have taken two sets. X is a domain. Y is a co-domain. In X, we have taken 1, 2, 3 the elements. In Y, we have taken A and B the elements. 1 is connected with A in the codomain. 2 and 3 both are connected with the element 2. As two elements having same image, it is not 1 to 1 function. It is a many to 1 function. Both the elements of the codomain is having pre-image. So, it is a on to function. To demonstrate this activity, first we should be very clear with this type of function. One element of domain is connected with one element of codomain means it is 1 to 1 function. All the elements in the codomain having the pre-image means it is on to function. Now we will stick to the writer part. The aim of this activity is to demonstrate a function which is not 1 to 1 but on to. For this as I told earlier we need the prerequisite knowledge as the knowledge of all types of function. I told if one element of domain is connected with one element of codomain, it is one to one function. M more than one element of the domain is connected with one element of the codomain means it is many to one function. If all the elements of the codomain having a pre-image means it is on to. If any uh, element are left out means it is into. Now the required materials. Two color papers. Either you can take color paper or you can take cardboard and connect this um, uh, mapping using the thread. That's why I have mentioned thread or color paper. Here I have mentioned I have connected with the uh, lines. But if we wish we can join using a thread. It will be little different at integrated one. Now the procedure cut two color strips of the same size. To represent the domain X and the codomain Y, mark the elements 1, 2, 3 in X, A comma B in Y. So, so, so the set X is 1, 2, 3 and set Y represents A and B. Join the corresponding elements of X to the elements of Y in such a way that it will satisfy the function of the given type which is not 1 to 1 but on to. Observation, what we observe from this. The image of the element 1 of x in y is the image of number 1 which is the element of x and the image in the set y is. So, we have to see which element uh, uh, to which element the number 1 is connected with. Here we can see 1 is connected with a. So, the image of 1 is A. Then the image of element 2. 2 is B. We have noticed it is B. The pre-image of A of Y in X axis. The pre-image of A. A its pre-image is 1. So here you can fill 1. The elements 2 and 3 of X has the same image B in Y. So it is it is telling that the elements 2 and 3 both are having the same image. So it is a dash function. Dash function means 
you can write not a uh, one to one function or it is a many to one function many to one function like this also you can fill then the elements of y has the pre image so it is or every element of y has the pre image so it is a on to function so this is what we have observed from this activity so from this activity we have learned to demonstrate any type of given function here you can even write any type of uh, given function or you can write what you have written as a the given function demonstrate we have learned to demonstrate the given function not one to one but on to like that also you can write the conclusion hope this write up part will help you once again i'll show the full write up part the representation in the left side of the record notebook then the write up part to be done same way you can write so like this we have completed activity 3 in coming videos we will be seeing the remaining activities too hope this will help you bye bye